Hey there YouTube, today we're going to be talking about what a motherboard, a mainboard or a logic board are. So I've had this question quite a few times where people will look at a computer uh, and it's not working or something and they'll say what's wrong and I'll say it's the motherboard and um, to them that's an extremely open thing. So I'm going to give you a better idea of what a motherboard or a mainboard or a logic board are. So first things first, I must point out that they are technically different things. So what's the difference? Well, a motherboard is what you tend to find in your laptop and your desktop. The key thing about a motherboard is that it's uh, essentially the support hardware for all the important stuff, but not the important stuff. So it connects the CPU to the PCI slots and things like that, but it isn't it doesn't have a CPU on it by default. Um, there are small exceptions to that, but most of the time the motherboard is the thing without other important stuff on it. So an example of this would be like this robot on the right here. It has attached to the front of it a motherboard and just there is a CPU. Now that CPU is detachable and without the CPU it's, um, it's essentially kind of useless. Um, motherboards have lots of connectors on them because their whole point is to connect lots of devices together they on their own are fairly basic anyway so the next thing we come on to is a mainboard now a mainboard is what you tend to find in integrated devices like cameras or tablets uh, mobile phones things like that so what is a mainboard well a main board tends to be a board with everything important on it or a lot of important stuff on it. So in this case if you were to look at the robot's face this is of a camera of some sorts and it'll have all the important stuff so it's got the speaker, it's got the camera sensors, it's got a uh, processor and RAM and stuff like that all on the board and um, the reason it's called the main board is um, well because it contains all this important stuff and essentially if your mainboard were to go wrong it could mean a number of things whereas if your motherboard on your computer tends to go wrong it generally means the thing that connects all the other important expensive stuff uh, and that's the difference if your tablet dies because of the mainboard it's uh, often almost the entire cost of the tablet to replace whereas if the motherboard on your computer dies um, generally it's a fairly low process for replacing uh, low cost I should say for replacing it um, and the final thing we come on to is uh, logic boards. Now logic boards in the traditional sense tend to mean sort of basic boards that sort of do simple tasks. Um, how would you put it? So a logic board would be something like in a children's toy or something, something very basic. It could also technically be called the mother, uh, the main board. Um, but uh, Apple being Apple decided that they were going to call their everything's logic boards so their motherboards and their main boards they're all logic boards to Apple which um, fair enough I mean hey if they want to do that then why not but technically not correct so that's all for this video thank you for watching and I hope you understand them a little bit better